We should be clear. <laughs> I hope. Yes, suck it. God, that was close. Wow, all it took was a single sniff of the Cauldron Sisters candy to transform. Well, to transform Twig into an even larger candy craving maniac than usual. Oh. This could be a disaster unless you get all the candy back. <laughs> oh god. Need the heels. Forget you saw that. I was just curious to see if that would show up the same way if, uh, I haven't been to book three yet. Wow, you saved us from that candy-obsessed moglin monster thing. I guess that would make him a moglinster. Real problem is the part of the spell that I cast delivered. Delivered samples of the Cauldron Sisters candy to all local houses as soon as it was done cooking. Oh, that's... That is a uh, super convenient spell. If there are Moglins in or near those houses, that could be a disaster. Our, comp <sighs> Our company will be ruined before we even... Ha before we have even sold our first piece of candy. <laughs> Your chaos is as beautiful as you are. Mew. Bubble is right, Mix. This is serious. Unless we can get the candy back, people could get hurt. We need to work on a spell that might reverse the effect on the candy. As our new part-time candy consultant, we need you to go door-to-door -to, -door to gather as much of that candy as you can. Be careful. There might be Moglinsters in any house. And the, pumpkins, and the Pumpkin King's minions probably want revenge. If you hide your face underneath a mask, the Moglins might not see you as candy. If you bring us back enough of the candy, we'll let you borrow one of Bubbles' crazy masks from her crazy mask collection. Hey, those are my crazy masks, Trouble. Also, if you unlock all of the masks, we'll make a special armor for you. Are you ready to go door to door? To try to get our tricks back while avoiding the tr try to get our treats back while avoiding the tricks. Alrighty. Trick, it's a monster. Wow, pumpkin slice. I think I could effectively just go back and this would be done even if I didn't fight anything. But I don't know. I know there's incentive to like try and unlock something, but you know. I'm not gonna sit here and do this for 20 minutes. Oh, that was cool. <laughs> yeah, like hacky sacked that pumpkin at me. But yeah, doing that for several minutes here. 38 pieces of candy? Nice. I think I'll just go to one of... E I'll just go to each of the houses. Gone Callow's house? Ah, sweet. Candy. Sixty-three. Already over a hundred and one. Prinny Lahari's house? Trick, it's a monster. Alright. Doomwood Werewolf. Does he resist my weapon? Yeah, he does. Okay. That sucks. All right. 
right. Ow. That is not any better. Okay. Back to the rapier. Ow. Um, smoke. Oh, I am almost dead. Yeah, I think I can beat him. I say as I'm trying to fight this thing with less than 100 health with a weapon that he has a resistance to. I got this, though. Oh, come on. There we go. 26. Completed. Happy, happy Magalween. You got a pretty good amount of candy to take back to the Cauldron Sisters. Use it to unlock mag or Magalween masks, upgrade your harvest weapons, and eventually unlock the... or eventually level up the Pumpkin King armor. Harvest staff will keep that, I guess. Either sell it or... Alright, heal. Talk. This could really be have been a disaster for us. You're doing a great job gathering all the candy. We don't really care if you eat it, destroy it, or spend it in our shops as long as you get rid of it. What a waste to think we could be selling all of this candy if it didn't have that horrible effect on the Moglins. <laughs> I have to admit, you guys have done a really good job causing havoc. This night will go down in history as the Night of the Evil Moglins. Ah, Evening of the Moglinsters. Too long. How about just Mogloween for short? Ooh, we get our very own knight. This is fun. Mew. Bubble is right. The cat one, I mean. We don't really want to be famous for this. Remember, Toil, there's no such thing as bad publicity. Cauldron Sisters Candy will soon become a household name. I hadn't thought of it that way. Maybe this isn't such a disaster after all. Maybe we could do it again next year, but the candy could make mindless zombie slaves the great every wish. No! Mew. Sigh. Alright, I guess we'll... Uh... Unlock mask? Sure. Grab. Shops and pumpkin armor. Harvest weapon? Oh, actually, I have a weapon. Pumpkin King armor? Yeah, it's a special class. We're not gonna bother with that, because as I said, that would just be a lot of grinding that isn't fun to watch. So, we'll just, uh, do the boss fight. Wow, you gathered a lot of the candy that we made. If you keep gathering it at this pace, you should get, you should have every piece that we sent out soon. Now I just need to think of a safe way, moglin free way to dispose of it. <laughs> oh, I wouldn't worry about that. Meh. <laughs> Zorbak. This one, the one and only. Yum. This still, this stuff doesn't smell half as terrible as it looks. Thanks. I'm glad that I added all that mognip. If I had left it to you four witches, you would have ruined it. You're the one who added the mognip? You're the one who's caused this whole mess? 
than the one who almost ruined our family business and our family's name? Zorback, thanks to you, we can't sell a single piece of this candy. Since you ruined it, you owe us 200 million gold? Jesus. That price tag seems a little high to me. I'm adding the cost of employing Hunter as our part-time candy consultant and recovery specialist. As well as wasted ingredients, damage fees, and the damages caused by the Moglinsters, travel expenses for walking around Doomwood and recovering candy, the cleaning fees for Mix. Okay, I get it, I get it. I don't see what the big deal is, it's just candy. Sweet, delicious, amazing. Irresistible candy. It's our back, no. Why would you do that, you blue moron? I'm not sure. The smell was just too heavenly to pass up. The good news is I don't think it had any effect on me. Did you just rumble? Why, yes, I think I did. Uh-oh, bad news. It always is from you. What is it, trouble? That kind of gastrointestinal in, gastrointestinal reaction belies a very high suspicious susceptibility to transmogulinification. Smaller words, please. I think Zorbeck has a weakness to candy, and he's about to explode into some kind of super monster. Figures. Candy! Alright. Of course he did. Whatever. I like his staff still being in hand. That's funny. I wonder why I can't stealth right now. That's weird. Whatever. Poison. Poison. Rapid fire. I say ow, it missed. I'm silly. I think I'm having less trouble with. Well, I might not be now that I think about it. He's still over 100 hit points ahead of me. And I, uh. Yeah, he's still over 100 hit points ahead of me, so I might not be having quite as much trouble. Oh, he stunned me? What is this? It's the first Moglinster, but... Yeah. I am going to need to use a potion. Where did I just go now? All that I remember is this incredible assault on my taste buds, the pure happiness and candy form the taste of pure happiness and candy form, then then I was here. Zorbak you ate a piece of candy and destroy and transformed into a huge monster. Oh yeah, can the candy, that stuff is great. I'll think I I think I'll eat a little more. <laughs> Why is it just chilling out on the ground? Oh no you won't. You've caused enough trouble already. You'll have to take my place as the Cauldron Sisters' help until you've paid them off. You know that they won't let up until you've paid them back. Yeah, I know. 
Oh no, I have to work full time for the cute witches with their own doom cauldron. Could there be a worse fate? The oh no was massive sarcasm in quotes. Yeah, I got that. Come help us keep, think of a way to get rid of all this candy. Oh, hey, why don't we just toss the stuff into the huge wormhole that appeared right behind you? What? What wormhole? I'm not, am I just not seeing this thing? Why, why, why did you let him? Well, where, Zorbeck, I can't see any word. Zorbeck? What did you just, that's not even possible. Oh, my tummy feels funny. Okay, it's going to be okay. I think I'm going to do fine. Nope, not fine. Not fine at all. Jesus. Well, that's one way to get rid of all the candy. I guess Mogaloween is mostly saved. Only one problem left. Candy! How do I break it to him that he ate the last of it? This will require the power of a dragon lord. I still don't have any skills from my dragon, but I'll give it a whirl. Oh my god, yeah, this isn't going to turn out great at all. What? I can't change my elements in mid-battle anymore? I dislike that I suddenly started doing less damage. It's not like it's that big of a deal. I clearly can't win this. <laughs> Affected by stun? Really? Honestly, though, survived longer than I thought I would. Whoops. There we go. Alright. Put me out of my misery there. Uh, leave. Really? Okay. Well. That's annoying. That I'd have to fight him again. Man! I should have just done the let the dragon lord handle it. Alright, well. I don't really want to go back through everything, because that would be a little redundant. But, so we're going to move on to the next thing. I've been recording for 40 minutes. Oops. Oops. Alright. Which is, we are going to have a chat with Warwick. There we go. I am stupid. All right, uh, 
bring me more like Save Limcrest, River of Fire. Recently, the town mining of, or the mining town, the town mining town of Limcrest, to the west and south of here, has been having a lot of trouble with the local population, or local elemental population. That is, something has thrown them off, thrown off the balance between the elements, and has driven them mad. To add to their troubles, the river that runs beside the town, the river itself, has been set on fire. I would like you to go and investigate this river of fire. See if you can help the miners. I will see if I can find the source of the elemental imbalance. Ha, <laughs> suck it. Sitting, leaning in like this towards my monitor isn't the best thing for my uh, neck right now. It's still sore from the concert that I went to last night. Flame wing. Inferno Elemental. I still remember that volcano. You guys are jerks. Alright. Flame wing again. Wow, I just went silent for several seconds for no reason. Oh, yeah. Alright, Inferno Elemental. And I'm going to cut you. Aw, oh, man. That did significantly less than it did the other one. Yeah. Other time. No, oh, I'll still be good. Kill him before he can hurt me. This river goes on for quite a ways. Nice. Suck it. Wow. Now I'll take you down. And now I'll take you down. 